Hello everyone, myself Rashmi Jarosya. I'm a faculty of pharmaceutics at Ravi Shankar College of Pharmacy, Bhopal. Today I will explain a basic apparatus that is used for the determination of viscosity. Viscosity means the resistance to flow of fluid is known as the viscosity. It follows the Newton law of flow is known as the Newtonian fluid. And I'm explaining the viscometer that is used for the Newtonian fluid. This is the capillary viscometer. It's known as the Oostwald viscometer. It is also known as the single point viscometer. In this viscometer, a known liquid, this viscosity determined the name, us liquid ko hum is lower limb mein fill karte, lower bulb mein fill karte hain. And now, suck the liquid up to the upper bulb. This is known as the upper bulb and this is known as the lower bulb. And the capillary which is present in this area this is the capillary firstly we have to place this uh ustral viscometer in the vertical standing position and now fill the liquid in the lower limb lower bulb and suck the liquid in the upper one and now the time required to fall from the upper mark to the lower mark is noted the upper one consists of two marks one in this upper side and one is the lower side. So we have to determine the time to flow of liquid between these two marks. And same we have the same procedure. Three times we use samples ke liye and then we use karte hai. another reference sample that is most commonly used, water. Because we know the density and viscosity of the water. So same procedure will be followed for the water. And whatever values we put in the formula. Mein put karte hai. हमारे पास में अननोन सैंपल की विस्कोसिटी डिटरमाइन हो जाती है थैंक यू फॉर वाचिंग दिस वीडियो सब्सक्राइब आवर चैनल फॉर द मोर अपडेट्स